A CONTROVERSIAL VOTE IN Hillsborough COUNTY RIGHT NOW. THE SCHOOL BOARD IS GETTING READY TO VOTE ON CHANGES TO SCHOOL BELL TIMES. SOME PARENTS ARE NOT HAPPY ABOUT THE PROPOSED CHANGES BECAUSE THEY BELIEVE IT WILL DISRUPT THEIR FAMILY'S SCHEDULE. JEFF PATTERSON JOINS US LIVE OUTSIDE THE SCHOOL BOARD BUILDING RIGHT NOW. JEFF, A HEATED DEBATE ON THIS FOR WEEKS. Yeah, good evening, Jen. That discussion is going on in the building behind me right now. As a matter of fact, the school board taking this up. We have a crew inside monitoring what's going on. We'll update you as soon as it does happen. But you're right. A lot of parents have told the school board they aren't happy about this. The proposed changes could impact thousands of families. The changes are designed to stagger start times for schools, allowing more time for buses to get from school to school. For Hillsborough County, the changes could save the district more than $2.5 million in transportation costs. But for some families, those changes will upset the delicate balance of dropping kids off for school and then getting to work. Does that impact what you do in the morning? It definitely does because workday for me starts at 6.30. For NAS Camacho, it will mean the added expense of extra daycare. Um, I've had to use alternative uh, daycare, so before school starts and also after. The Hillsborough County School System will offer an early drop-off for elementary students, but at $20 a week and $80 a month, the extra expense adds up. For John Sykes, it's just an inconvenience. Would make it a little bit more difficult for the day because of rush hour traffic. Tuesday, school board members heard from concerned parents. And I encourage you to but for some parents, like Erin Travis, the changes are actually a good thing. My high school student, she thinks it's great. The earlier time will give her more time to do homework because she's in sports. Yeah, the school board could vote on this at any moment. We'll update you when that happens, Jen. Change is hard. Jeff Patterson, live in Hillsborough County for us tonight. Thank you, Jeff.